Stepping off to help children in Ukraine, dozens of runners and walkers taking to the streets of Half Moon this morning as part of the sixth annual Sasha's Superhero Run. News 10's Harrison Grubb now has more on their efforts. <laughs> Running and walking to help kids a continent away. It feels incredible. It, just everywhere we go, we see flags, um, Ukrainian flags, and people, everybody wants to help. Sasha's Superhero Run has been happening in Saratoga County for the last six years in honor of Sasha White, who unexpectedly passed away on Christmas Eve in 2016, just weeks after being born. The race's superhero theme is a way of honoring parents who lose a child too soon. We're just grateful for having people be here and help us remember him, and most importantly, help us say his name. You know, when, you, when your child dies, it's, you usually have fewer and fewer opportunities to talk about your children that are not around. In the past, the event exclusively raised money for the Ronald McDonald House. But this year, Sasha's parents knew they had to offer support to his mom's home country. I'm originally from Ukraine, and my whole family is from Ukraine. And, um, and some of them are still in Ukraine, some of them are displaced. $12,000 has already been raised to help a number of efforts in Eastern Europe, including money for the primary children's hospital in Kyiv, displaced families, and people on the ground helping those in need. Pretty much kids affected by the war in Ukraine, which is pretty much every child in Ukraine, unfortunately. It's help that hopes to make a huge difference as Ukraine's fight against Russia continues each day. Sasha's grandmother, who lives in Kyiv, just arrived in the United States, outlining what the situation is like in the capital. The war situation is terrible in Kyiv right now. The situation is really, really scary, but um, you know, people are dying. Uh, but um, life continues, and um, uh, people try to make the best of the you know, awful situation. I'm grateful for you know, to the United States for welcoming me and for everybody being here and helping honor my grandson, Sasha. Proceeds from this year's event will be split between the humanitarian efforts in Ukraine and the Ronald McDonald House. Reporting in Half Moon, Harrison Grubb, News 10, ABC.